I mean, as, as a health regime, have you yes. found it useful? I, I don't do it to lose weight, as some people think that. that, that Boys in the lower back. Can you feel how that I opens am, out? Yeah, yeah, it's a little bit softer. There's not so much pressure. But that's going to allow the lower back to even move a little more. So even with the breath, if you're breathing, inhaling, the abdomen will move, move against the mat. And as you exhale, the abdomen will move back towards the spine. Now, if you lift the knees, try not to cl clench the thighs, but just lift the knees up. And then we can start to, I mean, this almost feels like if you're standing up, right? But you, you know, whilst you do that, what you can probably feel is not only that your, your pack there is, is in your back, but you're starting to release through the, mm -hmm. the left, uh, the right waist, rather. So you're separating the hips from the right. Not, something, not it, natural. Not natural movement at all. But it gets right into it. It's I a very, the stretch. It's very simple. It's a very simple movement, but I really, one of my favorite ones for, for releasing the hips. There, good. And then come on up towards the ceiling. That's it. And tuck the chin in and get a sense of laying the spine. We've been working so much with the spine today. Just get a sense of laying the spine down onto the mat. Does it feel supported? Uh -huh.